Without him, we are nothing. Amen. So I am honored. You are honored. We are all honored because we're still in his presence. Amen. And we have this opportunity to come together and praise him as one Amen. in the body. Hallelujah. We are all members of his body. His body. That's an honor. It's a privilege to be able to serve him. Amen. The Almighty God. Amen. Hallelujah. Without Him, I am nothing. And I am a nobody. But yes. I just want everybody to have what God has given me. He wants to give us all that spirit of joy. Amen. The joy of the Lord yes. is my strength. Yes. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. Without Him, I am nothing. Amen. Without Him, we are nothing. Amen. But with Him, we can do all things. Amen. Hallelujah. Woo. And that's enough to give Him praise right there. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. There's none like him. There's never been none like him. There never will be another like him because he is. He is all in all. His name is Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus. Jesus. And I thank him every day. I don't just thank him on Sunday. Hallelujah. But I can't wait for Sunday to get here because I can get with my people and praise him. God, people. We are his child. We are, you are his child. And he loves us like no other. Amen. No, he. A mother's love is not greater than his love. Oh, his amen. love is even greater than the mother's amen. love huh? amen. that she has for her child. Amen. Think about it. Amen. How you love the children. How you love that baby when you cradled him in your arms. And he was just so, mm, you just loved him so. God loves us more than that. God loves us. God loves us. Yes. And He's worthy to be praised. Amen. He's worthy to yes. be praised. Hallelujah. He's worthy to be praised. Yes. Hallelujah. We got to get back in the closet. Amen. Amen. Not the closet of silence, but the closet of freedom. Amen. How many times do you get in your prayer closet? Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or how long has it been? Since you've been in his prayer closet. Mm -hmm. Wipe the dust. Because when you get, you know what I'm talking about. If you've ever been in your prayer closet, you know what I'm talking about. His love comes in like never before. When I just start praising him. Sometimes, even if I don't feel like praising him, I'm going to praise him. Yes. I'm going to praise him no matter what comes my way. Because he's worthy of my praise. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Amen. But we need to come together as a unit. Yes. Because we're supposed to be one in him. Amen. We're supposed to be followers of Jesus yes. Christ. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Pray. Seek his face. Get yes. in that prayer closet. Just start praising him. Just start saying, Amen. just say thank you, Jesus. Yes, thank Amen. You. Amen. That's, Amen. Right. that's all you just start right. Thank you, Jesus. Glory. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Glory. Thank you, Jesus. It don't matter where you're at. It don't matter whether you're at work. It don't matter whether you're at the grocery Amen. store. It don't matter where you're at. Yes. Even in church. Thank you, Jesus. Woo. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Tell him thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Just start thanking him. Hallelujah. Just start thanking him and say, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you for saving me, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you for bringing me out of that pit, Lord. Hallelujah. I was on my way to hell, but you saved me. You called my name one day. You said, come out, my son. Come to me, my son. He said, lay it all down in my feet. Yeah. Give it all to me. Hallelujah. Lay it all down in his feet. And just praise him. Glory. Woo, and he comes in Glory. like a flood. You can't hardly hold him back. He just, oh my God, hallelujah. Woo, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Come up praising him and thanking him. And he comes in, you just go to speaking in tongues, you just don't even know. You're just so thankful, you're so full of him because the Holy Ghost has come in. He comes like a flood. Hallelujah. He's worthy of my praise. 
He's yes. worthy of it. I pray that I didn't even know I was going to say all this. <laughs> Lord, faithful, thank you, Jesus. I'm just so thankful. I'm so thankful that I am a child of God. Hallelujah. Amen. And I'm thankful to be with other children of God. We are all His child. We belong to Him. He's worthy of our praise. He's worthy of our praise. Take Him with you everywhere you go. Because He's already there anyway. So you may as well talk to Him. You may as well visit with Him. You may as well fellowship. Even if you're all by yourself. Because you're not by yourself. Because He is with me. He is with you. He is he wants to talk to you. He wants you to listen. They that have an ear to hear. Yes, let him hear. Hear his word. Yep, yep. His word. Hallelujah. Because it's his word that's going to sustain you. It's his word Hallelujah. that you can stand on. Hallelujah. Yes. Ooh, glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mm, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Ooh, ooh, thank you, Jesus. Mm, hallelujah. Oh, Lord Jesus, I did it again. <laughs> Ooh, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Glory. Ooh, thank you, Jesus. I've got to get my glasses. Thank you, Lord. I'm so excited. It truly is an honor and a privilege to be here because we are together. We are together here as one right now. And I'd be better if I could find my glasses. Uh-uh. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Our goodness. The Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost. Praise God. The Holy Ghost. Yes. The Holy Ghost. Glory. The Holy Ghost. Jesus said, I gotta go. He said, but I'm not gonna leave you alone. He said, I'm going to send the Comforter, yes. the Holy Ghost, Amen. my Redeemer, hallelujah. hallelujah, my Redeemer, hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Woo. I love Him so. Amen. Because why? Amen. Why do you love God? Yes. Because He loved you first. Yes. Amen. He loved hallelujah. us first. Amen. Hallelujah. I'm thankful for my salvation today. Because yes. the Bible says you must be drawn by the Spirit. Hallelujah. And my God drawn me. Amen. He called my name. Hallelujah. I was in a pit on the way to hell. Oh, hallelujah. Woo, hallelujah. Oh. He's so good to us. Yes, he He's is. so good to us. Thank you so much. <laughs> you know, He don't want us to mess up. Mm. He don't want us to make mistakes. Mm -hmm. But we do. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. we're still human. Mm -hmm. But the closer we walk with Him, Deeper we get. Mm -hmm. Just just talk with him. Mm -hmm. Talk with him. Get in that prayer closet. Amen. I got off of that, didn't I? The prayer closet is very important. Yes. It's Amen. very Amen. important. Amen. Amen. Very important yeah. that you yeah. praise him. Yes. No matter I can praise him at work. I don't Amen. care. Hallelujah. I can praise him. Yeah. You know what? I don't have to be saying it all out loud. I'm praising him on the inside. Amen. I got Amen. the joy of the Lord. Hey, no matter what comes my way, I can say thank you. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I'm, I'm going to slow down. <laughs> He's just so good. good. Every day. He's so good. Same yesterday today. Oh, thank you, Jesus. You know, I really... Somewhere there was something about testimony this morning. Yeah, I was talking about it earlier. Mm. Testimony. Every single born again believer that knows him has a testimony. Amen. Amen. Yeah. How he brought you out. Amen. Yes. Woo. And you know what? That's what I'm going to do this morning. I'm going to give my testimony. Amen. I'm going to give my testimony. Hallelujah. Amen. Because God is good. Amen. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you. I'm just so thankful for what he's done for me. I just can't help but shout and say hallelujah. Amen. Sometimes and sometimes when you're down and out and when things are going wrong and everything just don't, don't seem like there's no way out, just praise him anyway. Yes. Amen. 
and He'll bring you on up out of it. Because you still got the joy of the Lord. He can't steal that from you. He can't take that from you if you don't give it to Him. No matter what I'm going through, I'm going to praise Him and thank Him. Because I know that's why. Because you know what He did for you that day. I'm so glad. Hey, where's your name written at? My name is written in the book. And he said, be glad. Amen. If we're nothing else, be glad that your name is in the book. Hallelujah. 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 I'm glad just for that. Yeah, Woo. That's Hallelujah. enough right there. Amen. Woo. Thank you, Jesus. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Woo. Okay. My testimony. How much time do we have? <laughs> Find your testimony. Sometimes it seems like it's so hard, but it's not. When God draws you, sometimes they know they're being drawn, but some people don't know they're being drawn until later, until after the afterwards. Sometimes months later, sometimes years later. But you get, begin to realize what He did for you and how He drew you. Ha! He drew me. And I didn't know I was being drawn. Because I was doing things that this old boy would just never do. And somehow I was walking in faith. Not knowing I was walking in faith. But he was drawing me. And I, I was like, man, I want to go to church. That's just totally not natural for me to want to go to church. <laughs> I grew up in church with, you know, Methodist church. Mm. But I'm almost 30, or I am 30. And God started drawing me. I wanted to go to church. I talked to my wife. I said, why don't we go to that church you used to go to when you was a little kid? And then next thing I know, I took a job in Ponca City, Oklahoma. Eight hours away from home. I ain't never done nothing like this in my life. Never had a welding job in my life. Never. But I had taught myself how to weld, but I didn't know if I could make it out there. And the job came up in Ponca City, Oklahoma. <laughs> of all places. And like I said, I was wanting to go to church. I was wanting to find church. And, and I took this job on a whim, not knowing whether I could make it or not. Eight hours from home, no money, just wasn't enough to get by on, you know. But I went anyway. And I passed that welding test. Hallelujah. Because of God. Hallelujah. God was dragging me to Ponca City, Oklahoma. Yeah. And I was just going. Wasn't even scared. I just went. And I got there, and I got that job, and I was so excited. I'm, I'm working, you know, and I'm still sinning. I'm still living in sin. I ain't got born again yet, but God is drawing me. And I, I, get, I get up Sunday morning, my first week there. I get up Sunday morning, I'm going to go to church. Well, I went around that week looking for a church. Driving around, this is before cell phones and all that kind of stuff, you know. It goes way back. <laughs> but God was drawing me. So I went looking for this church and I found this one church. I said, all right, this is where I'm going. I'm going here Sunday morning. I'm going to be here bright and early. Even for Sunday school? What are you talking about? Sunday school? I'm going to go to Sunday school? No, no, no. But I'm there. I pull up in time to go to Sunday school. Me, I never like going to Sunday school, but for some reason, God... Mm -hmm. When God is working, you, you just can't do nothing about it. You just got to make well, just roll with it, whatever it is. You don't even know what you're doing because I didn't know what I was doing. All I knew is I wanted to go to church. I wanted to get close to God again like I was when I was a kid. Woo! Hallelujah. And I pulled up and I couldn't get out of the truck. This is going to blow your mind. I could not get out of the truck. And it was like, God was, well, I, I know it was. 
It was the Holy Ghost telling me, this ain't where I want you. You're not getting out of the truck here. Don't do it. And for some reason, I listened. I had an ear to hear. And didn't know I had an ear to hear. So I cranked the truck up and I drove off. And I went down to this main street and I come down and I went south. And then I, something told me to turn here. So I got yeah, turned there. I turned right there. Y'all don't think I'm crazy, but I'm telling you the truth. God was directing my path. Amen. The Holy Ghost was speaking to me and I didn't even know it. Amen. Amen. Woo! Hey, he's so good. Huh? But he said, turn here. And then he said, turn here. And I'm going down this hill and I come to the intersection and I'm like, confusion. The devil don't want you to be here today. Right. The devil don't want you to get close to God. Amen. But we got to praise Him for what He's done yes. for us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I give Him the glory. Lord. I pulled up to this intersection and I'm like, what do I do now? There's, there's a church here. There's a church on this corner. There's a church right there. And there's a church right behind that church. But God said, this is where I want you. Amen. And I'm like, Okay, but what about this? But and I I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to do, so I just said, okay, I'm gonna drive around the block. I go down, come around, come back, and, and I just feel that that tug, the Holy Ghost telling me, that's where I want you, right there. I did this three, maybe four times. <laughs> around the block, same thing, same around thing. the block, same, same thing. thing. Yep. I'm just going in circles, <laughs> The devil's got me all twisted up on what to do. But just listen to what God is saying to do. The devil's sneaky. He wants to steal, kill, and destroy anything you've got from God. Don't let him have it. I'm here to tell you, go back to the enemy's camp and take it back. You don't belong to him. God gave it to you. He said, put his word to work. Put his word to work. Yes. Faith in action. Yes. Faith in action. Mm -hmm. Whew. Okay, I'll get back. <laughs> I can tell I went about about four times. And uh, I just got all confused and I said, forget it. I'm not even going to go to church. I went back down around the block. Instead of coming back around, there was a big old park over to the left. And I took that left. I was on my way out the door. I was on my way to hell. And a car passed me. About two blocks over from where I was. From that church. Three blocks. Maybe. And this car passed me. And some said, turn around and follow that car. You know God's moving. Amen. Yes. When you listen. Because you will find what you're looking for. Yes. Yes. I couldn't turn around quick enough. I turned. It didn't have no power steering in that old truck. It was, oh, it was terrible. It was terrible. But I was. But I was moving that thing three speed on. Look here. And when I pulled it, I seen him turn it way down there at the bottom of the hill. I seen him turn. I said, oh, I got him now. I'm going. I mean, I'm flying. I'm probably going 50 and 30. Maybe even 20. I don't know. And I turned that corner like he did because I didn't want to lose him because he's going to get up over the hill and then I'm going to lose him. Well, he turned right. Same where I've been going. Same place. I turned that corner and there he was sitting at that church that God was telling me to go to the whole time. But see, that's how God will intervene. He will take confusion and put it aside so you can see what you need to see. And to know that you heard what you heard when he said, that's where I want you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I got out of that truck that day. I didn't get saved that day. But I got out of that truck. And was so excited to see this. My brother, he is my brother. We talk all the time. We've been like this ever since that day. And it's because God used him. Mm -hmm. Hey! hey. God the Holy Ghost, yeah, because I obeyed, because I listened, yeah. not even knowing. But we met that day, had church that day. It was a church of God in Christ. 
Johnson Temple Church of God in Christ in Ponca City, Oklahoma. Pastor Timothy Johnson is my brother. He is my brother. Everybody in here is my brother and my sister. Amen. 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 Brother and sister. That's what we're supposed to be to one another. We're yes. supposed to lift each other up. Yes. We're supposed to give Him glory. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We're supposed to pray for those. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That are in need. We're supposed to heal the sick. Hallelujah. Yes. Thank Amen. you, Lord. Hallelujah. Woo. Thank you, Jesus. But I met Him that day. Am I going back and forth too much? No. 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 But I met Him that day. And I'm telling you, when you try to get close to God, all you know what's going to break loose. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And it sure does. Yeah. Yeah. My yeah. wife was a cheating on me. <laughs> and I ain't the kind of man I grew up in the South. You, that kind of stuff don't, don't yeah. work. Right. Ain't no joke. But God. Amen. Huh? Anybody know that? Amen. But God! Amen. Amen. But God! Amen. When God says different, it's going to be different. Ha! I was doing things I never would have thought of doing. Mm. Forgiveness was in my heart. Huh? Forgiveness. Unaware. But when he worked at the water treatment plant, right? I go down there and visit. This one night, I went down. <coughs> and just so happened, his half-brother was there. And he was a preacher, too. Mm. And I walked in and they was excited to see me. Because it was like instantaneous brothers, instantaneous I've known you forever kind of thing, you know? Hallelujah. And see, God orchestrates everything. Yes. He put my other brother there. And my brother Tim. And he put it, gave the freedom that I could go up in that water treatment plant and visit with them. Oh. <laughs> God is so good. They, yes, he we got to talking about the Lord and salvation. Whoo! <laughs> My goodness. The Holy Ghost. I can feel the Holy Ghost all day. Yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. They went to praying for me, laying hands on me. Hey! I gave my life to the Lord that day. Amen. I feel with the Holy Ghost all at the same time. Hallelujah. Hey, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to your name. Thank you, Lord. Woo. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. There's none like you. Amen. 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 And can't nobody tell your testimony like you can. Amen. Amen. We're supposed to take it to the world. Yes. Amen. What God has done yes. for you. Hallelujah. What God does for us every day. Hallelujah. Woo. He woke me up this morning and I'm yes. thankful. Hallelujah. He set me on my way today and I'm thankful. Hallelujah. Hey, he made my way to lunch. Huh? Thank you, Lord, for this food. Hallelujah. He made the way, not me. Not you. He made the way. He made the way. Yes, Lord. He made the way for you to cast all your sins upon him. He said, lay them down all at his feet. All of them. Not some of them. He didn't tell us to hang on to crutches. He didn't tell us to hang on to sin. He didn't call you up out of the pits of hell and save you and give you new life. Behold. Behold. All things become new. All them old things has died off. But behold, all things have become new. I'm a new creature in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. He didn't call me to go back in the sin. He didn't call me to do that. But sometimes... You get caught up because yes. old slew foot devil, he ain't never gonna stop. Nope, nope. He's always gonna try to get yes. you back in. Yep. No matter whether it be sickness, whether it be lust, whatever, money, job, wife, right, right. children. Yep. Don't put nothing before God. Amen. You give God the glory, you yes. give God the praise above Amen. all that's yes. going on in your life. Yes. Jesus said, Cast your cares upon me. Yes. And if we just learn how to praise Him woo, through the storm. Mm -hmm. When you're on the mountaintop, praise Him. Yeah. When you're down in the valley, yeah. praise Him. Yeah. When you're everywhere in between that, oh, praise Him anyway. Yeah. Praise Him. 
I will bless the Lord at all times. Yes. He didn't say sometimes. Psalm 34. I will bless the Lord at all times and His yes. praises shall continually be in Thank my you, mouth. Amen. 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 Thank you. Ooh. Ooh. Glory God, God, He's so good. God. Oh, amen. I'm just so thankful. Hallelujah. 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 Praise God. Mm. Be ye not ignorant of Satan's devices. That's what he gave us this for. This right here. Amen. 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 This right here. His word. Amen. His word. Hallelujah. Jesus came. He is the word. Amen. Hallelujah. This is him. Yes. Mm -hmm. He is the word. Hallelujah. He gives us all the instructions Amen. how to fight off that devil. Amen. How to fight off that devil. Hallelujah. You know what? I'm going I'm to give you another little testimony. Whew. My God is so good. Mm. You know, I don't care how close you think you are to God, Satan's still going to try to get you. And sometimes he calls you to slip and stumble. And you're like, and then you just have to go, Lord, forgive me. I'm so sorry. I messed up, Lord. Forgive me. But why, Lord? I'm on my way to work one morning. I'm like, why, Lord? Why? I mean, I'm crying like a baby. Why, Lord? Why? I'm doing everything I know to do. I love you, Lord. And I just want to praise you and worship you. I just want to thank you. And I want, it, I want this to never go away. Hallelujah. But why? <laughs> he said, it's funny because he told me why. I'm praying to God. I'm talking to the Lord. I'm asking Him why. You know what He told me? <laughs> See, we expect God to do everything. God wants you to act. Yes. God wants us to act upon His Word. Put His Word to work. Put His Word to work. And this is what He told me that day. He said, it was so simple. Resist the devil. And he will flee. He didn't say that he was going to resist the devil. He said, You resist the devil. Resist the devil. Resist him. Don't give him any leeway. Praise God. If all you can do is say hallelujah, say hallelujah. Sometimes that's all you can do is say hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you. And if you just start doing it, hallelujah. Giving him the glory and the honor. It seemed like all the troubles just go away. But when he told me that resist the devil and he shall flee, he's been there the whole time. He just never spoke to me like that. Resist the devil and he will flee. Oh my God. Ain't even got nowhere where I was, thought I was going. Oh, hallelujah. Mm, maybe we could. Okay. Second Corinthians. Ain't supposed to do none of this without scripture, right? But it's his word. Yes. His word. His word. Amen. His word. We got to stand on his word. We got to walk in his word. We got to walk. Mm. Hallelujah. Yes. If you make a mistake, you have an advocate with the Amen. Father. His name Thank is Jesus Lord. Christ. Yes. Amen. Thank you, Lord. That's the word. That's the word. His word don't lie. Hallelujah. If you mess up, get back up again. Amen. Don't lay there and water in it like I've done before. Don't lay there and have a pity party. Mm. Get back up. God has got His grace and His mercy. Ha <laughs> ha. His grace and His mercy. <laughs> My goodness. Get back up. You, Get on your feet. If you mess up, I don't care if you mess up a hundred times a day. Keep walking with Jesus. Amen. Keep walking with Jesus. And then you'll find the more that you walk with Him. He said, He told me one day, He said, Why are you still got them chains and them shackles on you? He said, don't you know I unlocked them locks years ago when you got born again? Why you pick them back up again? I said, I don't know what I let them go. And I'm like, oh, hallelujah. Amen. Freedom. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Freedom when you give them all to him. Amen. Give it all to him. All sin. Yes. And it gets cast into the sea of forgetfulness. Thank you, Lord. Give him all your sin. Give it all to Him. He didn't call us to live in sin. He called us to be free from sin. Amen. Amen. Thank, you. 
Lord Jesus, help me, Lord. Thank you. Okay, oh, Second Corinthians chapter glory. two. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Glory. Hallelujah. Anybody love God? Oh, hallelujah. Yes. Anybody love God? Yes. Does anybody love Him? Hallelujah. Does anybody say thank you, Jesus? Thank you, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Praise your name. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, we thank you for your word, Lord. Hallelujah. Woo, we thank you for each other right now, Lord. I'm thankful, Lord. Hallelujah. That I can be here with my people, Lord. Hallelujah. Your people, Lord. Hallelujah. Woo. We just want to praise you in spirit and in truth, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Everything belongs to you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Mm. A lot of this I've already said. Thank you, Lord. Chapter 2, verse 11. Well, I'll start at uh, chapter, uh, verse 10. Now, whom you forgive anything, I also forgive. Yes. Amen. For if indeed I have forgiven anything, I have forgiven that one for your sakes in the presence of Christ. Yes. Forgive. My goodness. Forgiveness is a big thing. If we can't forgive, he ain't gonna forgive us. Right. If we can't forgive, we can't see which way we can't see where you're going. Because you're living in sin. Be this is one of the ways that we, this is one of the weapons he gives us to fight off Satan. Be not ignorant of his devices. He wants you to not forgive. He wants you to not love. He wants you to hate. He wants you to live a lustful life. He wants you to cheat on your husband. He wants you to cheat on your wife. He wants you to beat your kids. He wants you to beat your wife. He wants you to beat your husband. Anything he can do to distract you from God, he's going to do it. He wants you to keep on doing what you do. He wants you to keep living in unforgiveness and hatred. And whatever the sin may be, it don't matter. It's all the same. Yes. It's all se it all separates us from God. No matter what it is. Hold on to your crutches if you want to, but I choose to let all mine go. I don't drink no more. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. I don't, my mouth. I'm going to tell you something. That's, that's something I forgot in my testimony. I'm sorry I keep going back and forth. But, the day I got saved, baptized in the Holy Ghost, mm. you know not another cuss word came out of my mouth. <laughs> and I was one of the worst, Hallelujah. I was worse than a sailor. <laughs> Everything come out of my mouth. I didn't, I didn't know any other vocabulary. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Just like that. Yeah. Never another word come Thank out of my mouth. Praise the Lord. I'm like, wow. See, that's my miracle. Mm -hmm. that's, my, that's a miracle. Yes. I never picked up another cigarette. Praise the Lord. From that moment. Praise the Lord. From that Amen. moment, I didn't even have a desire for a cigarette. <laughs> Why? Because Amen. I laid everything down that day, that moment. Yeah. That's how I got filled with the baptism of the Holy Ghost that same day. That same moment. Hallelujah. He gave it all to me because I gave it all to Him. And that's what we got to do, people. That's what we got to do. We got to give it all to Him. Everything. Hallelujah. And He'll light your path. Woo. Thank you, Lord. He'll light your path. All you got to do is follow the light. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. <coughs> so be ye not ignorant of Satan's devices. Study this word. Yes. Read his word. Mm -hmm. The more I read his word anymore, it's like it's like it just comes off the page. It like comes to life. And it's like, wow. Wow. The more you praise him. The more you thank Him, yes. the more He's going to show you every day. Get in your closet and just love Him. Mm -hmm. Just love Him. Invite Him in. Yeah. Say, come on in, Holy yeah. Ghost. Hallelujah. Yeah. Have your way today in me, Lord. Hallelujah. 
Hallelujah. Speak to me, Lord. Hallelujah. I want to hear you today, oh God. Hallelujah. Let him live in you. He wants to woo, He wants to guide you into all truth. He wants to guide you into the perfect love of God. He wants to show you how to love everybody, no matter what they do to you. No matter how they treat you. Woo! Don't matter what you look like. Don't matter what you smell like. Don't matter whether you're big as a house or skinny as a bone. Thank you, Lord. God. God inhabits the praises of His yes. people. Yes. Even if you're sitting in a room by yourself, Thank or you're God. sitting up in the church today, if you praise Him, He comes in. Oh, Hallelujah. Hallelujah! When you praise the Lord, He comes in. Thank you. Woo. Thank you, Jesus. I'm just so thankful. I don't forgot where I was, but I'm just so thankful for the Holy Ghost. Man, it just that was just such a miracle to me. He took those cigarettes away. He took that alcohol away. He took that nasty talking mouth away. Healed my marriage. Like right now. Thank you, Lord. Right now. Yes. Hallelujah. It wasn't a it was right now. Yes, Lord. All of that was right now. Thank you, Lord. Because he's a right now God. Yes, yes. Hey, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank thankful. You, Lord. I can't say it enough. I'm so thankful for His Word. Yes, Lord. Whew. All right. Be you not ignorant of His devices. Thank you, Lord. Words are going. Chapter 2, verse 11. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was just kidding. Chapter 2, verse 11, you wrong. <laughs> <laughs> My God is so good. He's so good. He's so um, good. Yeah. Okay, let's read Revelations 12 and 11. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Glory to His Thank name. Glory to His name. I had it marked. Still had it marked. Mm. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Do you love His Word? Yes. Amen. Does His Amen. Word speak to you? Thank you, Lord. Yes. His Word. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let the Holy Ghost just lead you. Okay, I'll start at verse 7. Chapter 12, verse 7. And war broke out in heaven. Michael and his angels fought yes. with the dragon. And the dragon and his angels fought, but they did not prevail. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Nor was a place found for them in heaven anymore. They was in heaven. And they want to take over God. Ain't happening. Mm -hmm. So the great dragon was cast out, that serpent of old called the devil and Satan, who, who deceived the whole world. Mm -hmm. mm. And all you got to do is no matter where you go, just look. Just look. Yeah. Turn the TV on, yeah. hear the news, yeah. all you hear is garbage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <coughs> This is what he's talking about. Mm -hmm. He's deceived the whole world. And, and if you're born again, you can see it. Yep. Yes. Yep. If they're not born again, they can't yep. see it. They don't understand what we're talking about. Yes. They don't see it. But I know we do. The world is crashing down around us yes. because Satan has got a stronghold. Forgive him, Lord. And we got to stand up yes. for righteousness' yes. sake. Yes, Lord. Huh? We got to stand up and declare the word of God Hallelujah. to everybody. Hallelujah. Don't matter where they at. Yes. You got to show them that love. Where else are they going to get it? Amen. We, the body of Christ. Hallelujah. Jesus is the head, and we Amen. are the body. Yes. Lord. With many members. Thank you. Lord. I better stop. <coughs> He said, Then I heard a loud voice saying in heaven, Now salvation <coughs> and strength and the kingdom of our God and the power of His Christ have come. Yes. For the accuser of our brethren, mm -hmm. who accused them before our God day and night, has been cast down. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
And what does it say? And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb. Hallelujah. By the blood of the Lamb. And by the words of what? Their testimony. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And they did not love their lives to death. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you. Thank you for your word, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you for your word. Hallelujah. Ooh. Mm. He's just so good to us. He's so good to us. Thank you, so he, you know he's good because he gave us this word. Yes. His word. Thank you. It's not my word because I'm just a nobody. Mm -hmm. But it's his word. Amen. It's his word that will lead us and guide us into all truth. Yes. If we just let the Holy Ghost have his way. <laughs> huh? Give everything you got to him. Don't hold on to nothing. Because he told me to Glory. let them chains go, and I tell you what, I've been free ever since. Amen. And every now and then that devil try to carry it back in, and I say, Get thee behind me, Satan. Amen. God said I can trample upon your head. God said I can stomp you in the ground. Because he said it's in his word. It's what his word says. We walk on scorpions and snakes. Huh? We will trample them under our feet. Thank you, Lord. Ooh, thank you, Jesus. Ooh, Romans 6. Chapter 6. Ooh, Lord God, it's so good. Mm. Oh, Lord, help me, Jesus. Start at 15. It says, What then? Shall we sin because we are not under the law, but under grace? Certainly not. No. Certainly not. He said, Do you not know to whom you serve? Hallelujah. And you know there's, there's a lot of Christians that don't know who they serve. There's a lot of Christians out there that have fell back or that have they didn't push forward. They didn't stumbling blocks get in the way. And that's where we come in. We're supposed to help one another along. Yes. We're supposed to love one another. Hallelujah. Huh? We're yes. supposed to help one another, yes. pray for one another, lift each other up. Yes. Oh, he said, do you not know that to whom you present yourselves slaves to obey? Mm -hmm. Wow, goodness. You are that one slave whom you obey. Mm -hmm. Whether it being of sin, you're a slave to sin. Mm -hmm. If you're living in sin, you're a slave to sin. It don't matter if it's just one. Yeah. It don't matter if it's just one. I don't want to be a slave to sin. No. <coughs> Hallelujah. And just because you make a mistake doesn't mean repent. 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 Thank you, Lord. Tell God you're sorry. Yes. He forgives you even before you ask, but He wants you to hear you ask Him. Lord, forgive me. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Lord, forgive me. I've been so stupid. Yes. And I tell Him that. Because sometimes you're just stupid. Yeah. Yeah. I do stupid things. And I have to ask God to forgive me. Yeah. But I'm trying. See, he said, strive for perfection. Mm -hmm. I ain't going to be perfect, but I'm showing up and I'm trying to strive for it. I, because I love him so much. He's been so good to me. Hallelujah. Whether it be, whether of sin leading to death or of obedience leading to righteousness. That's where I'm headed. Hallelujah. Righteousness. But God be thanked that though you were slaves of sin, hallelujah, yet you obeyed from the heart that form of doctrine to which you were delivered. Hallelujah. And having been set free from sin, Thank you, Lord. you became slaves of righteousness. Yes. Hallelujah. Man, I'm so glad. Hallelujah. I'm so glad. Call me a slave. Call me what you want. I know one thing. I'm born again and I'm headed up high. Yes, amen. He sets us at the right hand. Amen. My goodness. Together. Hallelujah. Ooh, hallelujah. Glory. Oh, my goodness. Romans 12 and 2. Did I go there yet? Nope. Ooh. Start with verse 1. I beseech you, therefore, brethren, by the mercies of God. Come on, somebody. By the mercies of God that you present your bodies a living sacrifice. 
Huh? He didn't stop there. He said, holy. Present your bodies holy. Hallelujah. Acceptable to God. Hallelujah. Yes, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. And all he's asking is a reasonable service. That means it ain't hard. You just got to let go and let God. Yes. Sometimes we make it hard. I know I made it hard. Ooh. Don't listen to the word and watch what happens. Mm. Listen to the word and try to live the word and try to walk the word every day. You know, it don't matter if it's a thousand times a day. Ask the Lord to forgive you. And keep pressing forward to that high calling which God has called you to be. He's called us to be high priests. Huh. We are His children. He calls us sons and daughters. My goodness. To be... Mm. My Jesus. He shows us how much He loves us every day. Because He woke you up this morning. Amen. He brought you here today yes. or wherever you're at in this world. It's all because of God. Amen. The just and the unjust. Yeah. Huh? He causes them to breathe too. That's right. And we must not ever forget where we came from. Never forget. Never get high-minded. Never think you're better than them because they, 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 ha they haven't come to know Jesus yet. But God, just the same way He saved you, He can save them too. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Blood bought. Blood washed. He washed me white as shit. Yes. Ooh, I'm so thankful. Thank Hallelujah. You. Hallelujah. Thank, you. Mm. Thank you, Jesus. Present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy, acceptable to God, which is your reasonable service. <coughs> and do not be conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind, that you may prove what is that good and acceptable, perfect will of God. Amen. Hallelujah. See, He don't make it hard. He gives us the instructions. He gives it to us. He gives it to us. Ephesians, did I go to Ephesians 2? Ooh, hallelujah. Mm, thank you, Jesus. And James, where does that see to have that James? Yes, James 4 and 7. James 4 and 7. Therefore, submit to God. Mm -hmm. Trust the devil. I already said this a while ago, but submit to God, <clears throat> resist the devil, and he will flee from you. He goes on to say, draw near to God. Huh? Draw nearer to God. Draw nearer to God. Yes. Draw nearer to God every single moment of your life. I don't even in your sleep. In your sleep, draw nearer to God. So that means 24-7. Ooh, hallelujah. Draw near to God, and He will draw near to you. That's, ooh, I love that. Cleanse your hands, you sinners, and purify your hearts, you yes, double-minded. Ha! My God. Just praise Him and thank you. Just praise Him. Thank you. That's all I can do. Yes, thank you, Lord. That's all you got to do. Because He will lead you from there if you just begin to praise Him and thank Him. Get in your closet on a daily basis. Get in your closet even if it's one hour a day or two hours a day. Maybe it may be every hour, but get in your closet and talk to the Lord. Amen. And He will show you. Yes. He will direct you. Ooh, hallelujah. There's nothing like that feeling when the Holy Ghost just takes over. Okay. What was that other one? Ephesians 2. Ephesians chapter 2. There we go. 
God, by the way, some of these, these scriptures are, they're all my favorite, but some of them are, seem like they're more favorite than others. <laughs> I just love his word. It, it, it tells me how to live. It gives me the, the guide to go by. Hallelujah. You know, and he lets us know that, hey, when you're struggling, why you're struggling, praise me. Hallelujah. Praise him at all times. Praise Him at all times. And you He made alive who were dead in trespasses and sins in which you once walked according to the course of this world, according to the prince of the power of the air, the spirit who now works in the sons of disobedience. Talk about the world. Mm -hmm. Among whom also we all once conducted ourselves. Sound like some folks forget about where they come from. Mm. We can't forget where we come from. Mm -hmm. We got to remain humble before God. And love them because that's the only way they're going to know Jesus. Mm -hmm. Among whom also we all once conducted ourselves in the lusts of our flesh, fulfilling the desires of the flesh and of the mind, and were by nature children of wrath, just as the others. <laughs> but God, huh? there it is right there. But God intervened in my life. Yes. But God saved me one day. But God, hallelujah. Amen. Woo! Amen. But God, oh, Lord. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. who is rich in mercy, because of His great love with which He loved us. Yes. Hallelujah! <laughs> I got reason to praise Him. I got reason Amen. to say thank you. Hallelujah. I got woo, glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. He's worthy of our praise. Yes, He is. Even when we were dead in trespasses. Huh? Uh -huh. huh? That tells you he's there for the just and the unjust. I was unjust, but he saw fit to call my name one day. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He saw fit to call your name one day. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Huh? Even when we were dead in trespasses, he made us alive yes. together with Christ. Yes, hallelujah. It's for by grace you have been saved. Oh, amen. Whoa. Hallelujah. Ain't nothing I did. Ain't nothing you did. You were saved by grace through yes. faith in Him. Jesus Christ. Amen. He is the way. Thank he you. is the light. He is the only way to the Father. Yes. It's through Jesus Christ. There is no other way. There's many people out there today say there's many ways. They say there's many ways to God. But that ain't what Jesus told me. That ain't what my Bible says. The Word... Amen. says there's only one way. Yes. There's only one way. Oh, and that's yes. through Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Mm. Mm. Thank you, Jesus said, mm. Mm. when you're baptized, what did he say? He said, Jesus said it now, baptized in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. Yes. That's one, two, three. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Woo, glory. Hallelujah. There's only one way to the Father, and that's Jesus Christ. Amen. Without Him, we're nothing. Amen. Without Him, we're just walking, clanging cymbals. Right. Talking noise. Talking noise. Hallelujah. Ooh, there's a lot of noise talkers. Ooh, Lots of noise talkers. Lots of noise talkers. But if there's, God said if there's no love in that noise you're talking, if there ain't no love in that noise you're talking, if there ain't no love in that noise you're talking, don't matter who, don't matter if it's me, don't matter who it is, the, the, the bishop, don't matter. That noise don't come with love. Hallelujah. That noise is null and void. That noise you're talking means nothing. Amen. And there's too many people talking noise today that don't love. 
they love they self. They put their self above God. Oh, God. But I will never back down from that. There's only one way to the fire. His name is Jesus Christ. Amen. Mm. Thank you. Mm. Hallelujah. Mm. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Oh my goodness. How much time do we have? Am I being too long? I don't know why I keep moving back and forth, but but God. But God. Amen. Think about it. But Jesus. The verse that we've read probably 10 million times throughout your life. John 3, 16. For God. For God. So loved. God the Father, He, this God the Almighty, mm -hmm. the Almighty One, mm -hmm. He loved the world so much, He did not want to destroy us. Mm -hmm. He loved us so much that He sent His Son. Mm -hmm. My God, could you do that? Could you send your Son to save everybody else? To lose your son. But he gave his only son. Because he loves us so much. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. I'm so thankful yes, that he loves me. Yes. He sent his son. Jesus. Yeah. Jesus came. He came by way of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Huh? It's in his word. He came by way of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. The Holy Ghost. Jesus became a seed. And the Holy Ghost put that seed in Mary. Mm -hmm. Tell me they don't work together as one. one. Say it out loud. One. 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 Say it out loud. One. 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 God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Ghost. Yes. They work together yes. as one. Oh, yes. Yes. They are of the same mind. Amen. They are all of the same spirit. Hallelujah. Yes. They work Hallelujah. together as one. God so loved the world that He sent His only Son. Yes. Huh? Hallelujah. Yes. And Jesus was willing yes. to go. Huh? Hallelujah. Yes. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you so Thank much you, for coming. Oh, hallelujah. He came Thank as a you, seed and the Holy Ghost brought Him. And the Holy Ghost planted that seed. And He was born born of a virgin Mary. A woman that never had sex before. This is impossible to man. Yeah. But God but God sent His Son by way of the Holy Ghost. Huh? Hallelujah. And He grew up and He's seen all the wickedness in this world. He's seen. He already knew why He came. But He saw the wickedness in the flesh. Yeah. He felt the wickedness in his flesh. Yeah. We see the wickedness yeah. every day. Yeah. Jesus saw it every day. The wickedness. But what did he do? He still loved them. Thank you, Lord. Thank he you. saved people. Thank yes. you, Lord. Woo! He showed people the way. Hallelujah. Amen. He healed people. Amen. Thank you, Glory. Jesus. He showed them a way out of darkness. Thank ah! you, Lord. Hallelujah. And there's still those today that want to refuse the light. They want to continue in darkness. But Jesus is the light. He is the Amen. way. He is the truth. Yeah. There is no other way but Jesus. Amen. And you know it's so sad that Jesus, when that day came, when His time was up here, on this earth, in the flesh, whoo, They beat him. Mm -hmm. They beat him. They whipped him. They whipped him. They stripped him of his clothing. They whipped him. Beat him. Can you imagine taking that and still being able to breathe? All the flesh is from head to toe was ripped off. And he yet carried that cross. He yet did it. 
for you and me. Amen. He did it all. Thank you, Lord. He did it all for Thank us. Thank you, Lord. He did it all for us. Thank you, Lord. So why not walk proud? Thank you, Jesus. Why not have the joy? Yes, Lord. Amen. Why not speak His Word? Yes. Why not show somebody Jesus? Hallelujah. Show somebody Jesus for what He's done for me. Yes. And what He did for you. Glory. <coughs> this says He was unrecognizable. Yeah. And was beaten so bad. And you know what puts a smile on my face? Is they could not kill him. Amen. They could not kill him. Amen. You can't kill God. I don't care who you think you are. You can't kill God. And they thought they could. They thought they could kill him by putting him on that cross. No. The Bible says he gave up the ghost. Thank you. Mm. He said it is finished. Amen. And he gave up the yes. ghost. Thank you so much, Lord. Because he was who he was, Amen. he would have never died if he hadn't just gave up the ghost. <coughs> because you can't kill God. Amen. His spirit had to leave the flesh. Yeah. That's the only way that body died. <laughs> Hallelujah. Woo. But I'm just <coughs> so thankful for what he's done. I know I keep saying that over and over, but my goodness. Mm. <coughs> and then he rose. We have a living, we have a living Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Amen. He rose on the third day. Yes. Mm. Amen. Hallelujah. He was seen by how many? I don't know how many it was. Yes, thank you, Lord. For what? 40 days or whatever it was. 500, 500. Hundred something days, wasn't it? There's so many folks that don't even want to accept him as the Son of God. But all we can do is pray for them. The Bible says to love your enemies. Yes. He says to bless those who curse you. I he said, do good unto those who do you wrong, who despitefully use you. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, Lord Jesus, help me. Because some folks are just nasty. Yeah. yeah. Some folks are just... Whew. But I love them anyway. That's Amen. what we got to do. Amen. It's the love of God. Yes. Amen. It's His love. Yeah. It's His love. Yeah. I'm so thankful. For his love. Because you know, he shows you how to love. <laughs> if we just let him, if we just let him go to your closet, I urge you, go to your closet. Go to your closet. And the more you go to your closet, the more you want to be. Amen. <laughs> you want to be in his presence like that at all yeah. times. Because <laughs> there's nothing like, there's nothing like walking in his presence. Yes. There's nothing like being in his presence. Nothing. Woo! Nothing like being in His presence. Hallelujah. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Mm. Praise God. Thank you, Lord. Lord, I thank you. And I praise you, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Lord, I just glorify your name today, Lord. Lord, we just want to lift you up today, Lord. Hallelujah. We just want to give you the praise today, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Ooh, hallelujah. Ooh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. How many have ever been to the valley? Ooh, the valley. Mm, the valley. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mm. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Mm. The valley. The valley. It's where God brought me out of. The valley. Mm. Hallelujah. Psalms 23. Psalms 23. Mm. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Yes. 
Oh, thank you, Lord. The Lord is my shepherd, and I shall not want. Yes. Mm, how many times we've read this? He makes me to lie down in the green pastures. Hallelujah. He leads me beside the still waters. Hallelujah. He restores my soul. Thank you, Jesus. You know, David was a praising man. Mm -hmm. David liked to praise the Lord. Amen. David liked to dance before the Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. Woo! Yes. He shout. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He shout. Thank you, Jesus. Dancing in the street. Hallelujah. David was a praising man, and he's praising him right here. He restores my soul. Hallelujah. He's restored your soul. Hallelujah. Woo, you once were lost, but now you're found. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He leads me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. He, don't do it. he does it for his name's sake. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. And he says, Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, yes, they comfort me. You prepare a table. Ooh, my goodness. Thank you, you prepare a table before me. Where? In the presence so of my enemies. Hallelujah. 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 He's going to make the devil watch. Amen. Hallelujah. If we just stand on his word. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> Come to the table. Come to the table. Come to the table. Brother Hagin said it one time. He said, there's a lot of you don't come to the cross. He said, but don't stop there. He said, come on up to the table. Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Where God has prepared a meal for you. Where God has prepared it for you. In the presence of the enemy. Hallelujah. Huh? Glory. Hallelujah. He made him sit there. He couldn't say a word. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, praise Lord. We are at his right hand. Hallelujah. And the devil can't touch you if you don't let him. That's right. Glory, glory, glory. And you don't let him by. Thank you, Lord. Not that you're going to not make a mistake. You don't let him because as soon as, it, soon as you, you know you've done wrong, you say, Lord, forgive me. I'm sorry. Forgive me, Lord. Oh, my God. And mean it in your heart. Mean it in your heart. Ooh, hallelujah. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup runs over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Hallelujah. My goodness. Hallelujah. We, got, we promised. We promised. We promised. We belong to Him. Amen. Thank you, Lord. I, he is my God. He is our God. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Okay. I think I've been long-winded enough. <laughs> Ooh. Praise the Lord. Mm. Thank you, Lord. Praise God. Pastor Thank Sam. Jesus. Thank you, Father God. Thank you, Lord. I could go on and on now. <laughs> I, I just... Man. I have so many scriptures that I wanted to bring forth, but this ain't got time to do everything in one day, huh? Yeah, we can stay here. <laughs> Jokesters. <laughs> Please. Oh, Jesus. See, what you don't understand is you're witnessing a walking, talking miracle that you're not aware of. Mm -hmm. this, this brother called me up yesterday at about... Six o'clock? I don't know what time it was. <laughs> he said, we, I knew he was sick. And I told him, give me till, don't give me any later than Wednesday. Notify me so I have something I can prepare. I didn't hear from him. Well, I called him. He didn't call me. I called him. He said, brother, I'm, I'm sick. He said, I don't think I can do it. He said, I don't know how I'm going to do it. I said, well, listen, I don't want to put any pressure on you. But if you can't do it, we're both in a jam here. And so I started, I, I started working and working, trying to, I was working up a sermon. And uh, then he, he and I connected again. He said, I'm going to be okay. I'm going to be okay. Well, he was more than okay this morning. Hallelujah. <laughs> 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 I was not a person that was sick That's on right. a sick bed or dead or right. dying. Yeah. But I got to tell you, what a wonderful, it really is a yes. phenomenal thing to be able to hear a testimony of what God has done, the grace of God, how He's so sufficient, bringing somebody up. And you don't really hear it a lot when a person gets saved, that there's an immediate turnaround, mm -hmm. an immediate mm -hmm. baptism of the Holy Spirit, mm -hmm. an immediate cleansing of the tongue, oh, an immediate healing of a marriage, 
an immediate mm -hmm. cleansing of a of a path of what a person's gonna what the Lord's gonna do with a person. A lot of times those are moderate changes in a person's life. But you know, God for for the Lord had to, to have taken him and told him not to go to other churches, go to this church. Mm -hmm. I don't know if any of you have ever had that kind of guidance, that adequate uh, particular guidance from the Lord, there's nothing like it. Amen. I can't say that I've had uh, many episodes, maybe a few, but that was just remarkable to me. And um, mm -hmm. it was That really life. happened, too. <laughs> <laughs> it was strange to me, too. It really did <laughs> But I don't want to leave until I ask you this question. We just, wish, we just uh, uh, concluded our fasting and praising. Uh, has anybody seen a result? In regards to what you've been praying for? I didn't fast all as much yes. as I should have, but I've seen results. Okay. Okay. Yes. Well, yes. absolutely. You know, God has the blessings, what's called the blessing of omission. Okay? When you're going to go into something, He says no. And He backs it up. That's called the blessing of omission. You could have died on that operating table. God knew it. God pulled back the reins of medical science. Did not allow for you to go through what you had already prepared your heart and your mind and your physical well-being to be there to be operated on. God saved you. Right. You know what that means? Like, you owe him big time. Right? And you know what? Really honestly, God saved you because God has a big plan for you. You have no understanding of what it is. It may be under the skies right now. But I want you to know that I've seen it in you a long time. Yeah. God has something. He's going to blossom in your life. Amen. He's going to blossom out. You are going to be a yes. person that you have no idea. Yes. How did I get to this point in my life? You think of yourself as lowly, Amen. inadequate, amongst the many. Yes. You're, you're, you're the smallest, the puniest. Yes. God has you designed. You're going to be above Amen. most. Right. You're going to be above right. most. That's why God is protecting you. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Was he talking about me? <laughs> Brother, I really love you. That's real. Amen. That's real what he just said to you. That's real. Believe it. Believe it. Hallelujah. Believe it. Trust me. I know because that was it. I felt, who am I? Amen. I'm not worthy. Look at all the mess I've done. But God. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. We are two sinners saved by grace. Amen. Amen. We are We're nobody. Saved by I am grace. a nobody. Yes. And I always tell people, don't look to me. Don't look to Brother Les. Because without Christ, I am yes. a failure. Yep. An absolute right. failure. Yep. Hallelujah. And so, but I'm not as big a failure as my sister. But I'm a failure. <laughs> oh. Oh. Sorry, I love you. <laughs> Take his ten dollars back. <laughs> but I want to close with a word of prayer. Father, I just thank you and I praise you for my brother. I, I thank you for his heart. I thank you for his spirit. I thank you for his enthusiasm, Father, to be holding on to you with everything that he has. I thank you, Lord God, that even for less, Father, that there's such bigger plans that you have, far beyond what he's recognizing himself to be. Father, and for every one of these people that are here, Father, in our audience, Father, it is just a path that they are on. A path that is not a conclusive path. Father, you have a design for every individual here. Father, let them continue to grow more and more and higher and higher and deeper and deeper into the call, the pattern, the design of what you have created them for, Father God. My desire is that more and more individuals are going to come in. They're going to hear the truth of the gospel. We may not have all the chandeliers and all the expression of wealth and appearance of a building. But Father God, we have the Holy Spirit here. And because of that, that I would rather that than anything else that other churches have. And I know that, Lord God, that by the presence of the Holy Ghost, 
we are going to see that there's going to be there's going to be an army that's going to arise, Hallelujah. an army that is going to be filled with the power of the Holy Hallelujah. Spirit. Hallelujah. They're going to arise. They're going to be sensational. They're not going to allow for the enemy to take them down. They're not going to be held captive any longer. They're going to have a two-edged sword in their hands, the praise of the God in their mouth, and they are going to carry out the uh, the plan of vengeance that the, the Lord has called them to do against the pattern of the enemy. And we are going to place Satan under our feet. We are going to continue to move forward, onward, higher and higher, higher as Christian soldiers. That is what you have desired for us, Father, and we are not going to quit until we come into the full fold of what you have desired for us, each and every one of us, to become. In Jesus' name, Father, I thank you. I ask that you give a blessing upon every person. Father, bless them mightily, anoint them, and give them a beautiful week as we, before, as we uh, come back together again next Sunday. In Jesus' name, amen.